Well, you know what? I think I'm going to do... Woo, where the balls is it? I want to try and find it with my own eyes. There it is. Boosh! Creature of the night. Investigate the winged creature stalking the skies. If you've ever seen any of the Batman animated series, otherwise known as Batmanime, I like to call it that. If everyone starts calling it that now, you know where it started? Me. Batmanime. Anyway, creature of the night. Let's do that. The bat creature's still at large on Miyagani Island. I'm going to hunt it down and take a blood sample. Determine who or what it is. Well, there we go then. I guess Bruce kind of said it himself. I say Bruce. Batman. He never refers to himself as Bruce, does he? Have you noticed that? Throughout the entire thing, Bruce Wayne is a separate persona because he is not Bruce Wayne anymore. The second his parents died, he left that name behind, didn't he? Bruce Wayne is no longer him. He is Batman. Through and through. Now it's a matter of finding the damn flying shit. Where is it? Aha! I found it. Unfortunately, it's kind of near a drone. So if I get killed... It's this freaking flying shit's fault. Well, that's what I'll go with anyway. Where'd it go? I've lost it now. Balls. Uh, oh, it's down there. Great. Thankfully, it does rise and lower in altitude, so you can keep up. Very nice. Let's land on top of it! Alfred, run analysis on the blood sample I just uploaded. Right you are, Master Bruce. I'm searching for possible matches now. <laughs> How you managed to get this sample is beyond me, sir. Ah, here we are. The blood is heavily mutated, but we have a partial match. A Dr. Kirk Langstrom. Search for any properties in Gotham owned or leased by Dr. Langstrom. Certainly. Uh, let me see. Ah, he and his wife lease a basement laboratory in Chinatown. I'm sending you the address. Now, as with all comic book type series, uh, backstories and or current stories and how things happen always change, don't they? So in the Batman animated series, I believe the creature is Kirk or his son. I don't remember anymore. It's been a long time since I've watched it. I say a long time, probably about three weeks. My memory is shocking though, as you probably know by now. Regardless, things change all the time, and it's like with the Joker's backstory, you know, most people are alright with the fact that he was a guy, criminal guy most likely, and he got dropped into some chemicals and then became the Joker. Um, I don't really like that backstory, I prefer a type of backstory where he's basically just the Joker from birth, I'd assume. Or well, I don't like to think of the Joker as being born, I like to think the Joker is like a a force of nature, because he always comes back, he's always there, he infects everyone he touches. He's basically a disease. And I like that idea. Like Batman, his story always remains the same, you know, like the, the backstory, his parents die. But then there's other things, like Flashpoint, where Bruce dies, and so does his mum, Martha, she dies as well, but Thomas Wayne survives, and then Thomas Wayne becomes Batman. So, different universes and different stories will always exist, especially within DC. DC is rife with alternate universes, which is a good thing. It's really good, but then again, sometimes you can't keep up, which is generally the case with most people. Then again, I love stories. You know me, I'm all about the story. Deafness in all humanity. How was that? 
perfect, sweetie. Uh, are you getting this, honey? I think so. Is the red light on? starts out with good intentions, doesn't it? Well, she hasn't been dead too long. Given the state of decomposition, I'd say she's been dead about four days. Wow. Imagine if that was actually correct. If this is about four days to six days, I'm going to be impressed with myself. So, uh, what we've done is merged the DNA of Desmodus Rotundus. Uh, so Blunt trauma to the head. Langstrom had no idea what he was doing. World's greatest detective and can't even give me a fucking time of death. There's a computer. Maybe it contains some answers. Uh, are you getting this, honey? I think so. It's the red line. This computer stores all of Dr. Langstrom's research. Well, yeah, while this is going on and there's no actual talking, uh, I don't think in the episodes in Batman anime, I don't believe that Kirk actually killed his wife. So, Arkham Knight, a lot darker. And I enjoy that. I love the dark stories. Mixing his DNA with a vampire bat? That was never going to end well. If I search through his files, I may be able to create an antidote to his condition. I need to isolate the man bat's signature and remove it from Langstrom's DNA. Oh shit, now I've got to sequence the integrity. Whatever that means. Um... How the fuck do you manage that? Hang on, wait. Do I just have to like match the swirls together? Wait, what What the fuck? I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh, hello? <laughs> What's going on? Well, this only moves like twice. Oh shit, I see, I see. I get it, I get it. I understand. I see what you have to do. Will what you have to do is swap the things like this so that the uh, the black is in a different one and then the yellow see a yellow coming down that goes to a different one as well, thusly. So it's only the white ones in specific areas and only the black ones in specific areas. There we go. I understand now. I didn't get what was happening the first time through, like with most things. Anyway, we should be about done here. This doesn't take too long, I'd assume. Although, it's taking longer than I'd like it to. There we go. We're done. Clean DNA sample. Now all I need to do is make him take his medicine. Alfred, I've synthesized a cure in Langstrom's lab. Now I just need to find him. Any idea where he may be hiding? He's not in control of his actions. He could be anywhere. No one knows this city better than you, Master Bruce. You'll find him. True that. And I only have to find him twice more, is it? And all I have to do is inject him with some of that cure. That delicious cure. Mmm. Kirk and Francine Langstrom. Such a shame she had to get bonked in the nose and die. Because like I say, in Batman anime, she survived. But now, if I save Kirk, he has to go back and realise he punked his wife in the face and killed her. How could he live with himself? Then again, he was trying to cure deafness in all humans, which is a very noble cause. And he could have done it if it weren't for those meddling kids. Wrong reference, I apologize. Anyway, let's find this flying fuck. Oh, I've heard the screech. And you know what that means. It's time to get saved by the bell. But no, it also means we get to fly after. Dr. Kirk Langstrom. 
and land on his back and administer the cure. Maybe. I'm flying very slow today. Must be the cape. Oh, Jesus. I have to circle around. Oh, great. One more time. One more time. We're gonna celebrate eight. Oh, yeah. All right. One more time. Ooh, that's a nice shot. At least you can see Batman coming. Oh! There it is. Finally. After 27 minutes of flying around Gotham City. I finally found you. Great. Well, this is the last time I have to clonk you in the back of the head, my friend. If I can manage to actually pull this off. Anyway, don't fly away! Where'd he go? Fuck! Oh! I found him! He's over there. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. It's Jason Bourne. Anyway, let's land on the back of this twat and take him out. I say twat, it's Kirk. I'm sorry, Kirk. You're a nice guy, really. Dr. Langstrom and administer the cure. I need you to prep an isolation chamber. I'm bringing him in. Sure thing. I'll get right on. Oh, baby. Well, oh shit. Can I tag this? There we go. Good shit. Whoa, didn't mean to do that. Thankfully, it's non-destructive. Oof, yes, good shit. We finally got Kirk Langstrom, otherwise known. Oh, I was kind of hoping for that to be a bit more epic than it was, but I just crashed my car. Oh, otherwise known as Man Bat, which the first time I heard Man Bat, I thought, what an absolutely ridiculous name for a character. What is that, like the opposite of Batman? But no, turns out it's just a man who turned himself into a bat by accident. Like most things in comic books and movies, everything happens by accident, doesn't it? Oh, I was trying to cure leukemia, and then I turned myself into a snail. Ridiculous shit, but then again, it's what happens in it. Not in real life, but well, accidents happen. I mean that, yeah, sure. I mean, look at you. Hey! No, but seriously, accidents happen. But then again, it's never as grandiose as this. Makes me cry, really. I want a man bat flying around screaming all night. Just when I think I've seen it all. He gonna be okay. Physically, yes. Uh, where's Francine? Where, where is she? She's dead, Kirk. No. She can't be. I, I didn't. What have I done? The serum, it changed you. You lost control. What have I done? What have I done? What have I done? <laughs> well, there we go. Case closed. Mission complete. Kirk Langstrom is now in prison. Which is kind of sad considering he didn't really intend on doing what he did, but then again, he did what he did, so there we go, he has to go to prison. Manslaughter, innit? 
Or would it be manslaughter? Because he wasn't actually a man during the time of his murder. It was a man bat. <gasps> I don't know, actually. Anyway, 31% complete. Ugh, still got plenty more to go. Not really too sure what I'm going to do next. I'll probably decide when I go flying through the sky. Also, got to find out how to get this guy's info. How do I get it, sir? Hey, Batman. How you doing? Fuck it, I'm Googling it. I need to know how to get this. This is pissing me off. Apparently, I have to press triangle. Who in the fuck would press triangle looking at the Green Lantern slash that Mr. Burns alien from the Simpsons? God, that freaked me out as a kid. Uh, you're working for Riddler. Hey, what? You're crazy. Batman's gone crazy, guys. What are you doing, Batman? Back off. Stand down, Batman! I don't know what he's talking about, guys! Are you sure? Okay, okay! I do favors for Enigma! Tell him when Gordon's on his trail, stick those dumb trophies of his around the place, that kind of stuff, but that's it, really! I'm not such a bad guy, I swear! I don't care. Hey! You can't throw me in here, I'm a cop! Not anymore. Well, there we go, I finally did it! Oh my god, after all this time. You press triangle? Really? That's ridiculous. Well, there we are then. Time to go do our next mission. Hopefully it's something exciting. Then again, they're all kind of exciting, aren't they? Well, there's a few that are a little bit samey. Like the uh, firefighter ones. After a while, that gets a little bit boring. But then again, we get to meet some very interesting characters and characters we haven't seen for a long time. So, I'm a big fan. Alright, on to the next mission.